so this is the maize which has grown which is now at three or four weeks three weeks old it has been raining like cats and dogs this side in zimbabwe and it has never given literally let up when it comes to the rain so this maize is actually doing well over there we did some sunflowers as you can see in the background there's some sunflowers we did not actually think at first when it's they came out we did not think that they would survive actually they've already got to a point where they're flowering but they're not big so it was really something that we did not really put our effort into into it then here are the ground nuts mm, not the ground nuts sorry this is the sugar beans these are the sugar beans that we have done and they have they're now starting to flower and choose to this high amount of water rainfall it is crazy in zimbabwe for the first time this year i have actually saying please can it stop raining so for these for the crops to actually be able to use this water up and really grow a bit because the water has been crazy but here's the sugar beans that we have planted they're actually doing very well so they're in the flowering stage so we're looking forward to having a quite a good harvest of the um, of the sugar beans um so let me take you through to the um, to the ground nuts the ground nuts have already started bearing ground nuts and we have had a few little ground nuts that we have already started consuming in fact i don't even say consuming people have started eating the ground nuts so through here is the ground nuts and as i say through to the ground nuts um they are doing quite well that has done some produced some pods this is the second batch that we are still still to produce um, pods but due to the amount of high rains that we have it's going to be quite interesting to see what happens to these kind of things so as i can say the ground nuts this year have actually done well for us for a change probably next year i will be talking that we have doubled the size of amount of peanuts that we have grown this year and probably it will be another big view of how much peanuts we would have done so we are really happy with the peanuts and i hope that this gives you a rough idea of what we are doing at the farm